So you already had contacts with Thr uh, Fritz von Erich through your uh, college days? Yeah, just on a fluke meeting, you know, he came up to me and said, kid, you might want to think about wrestling. And I was like, ah, I think I'll be playing football for a while. But yeah, I called Fritz back up when I realized there was no future in football for me. And he brought me down to the Sportatorium. Gary Hart gave me my first pair of trunks. And uh, I worked with Gino Hernandez quite a bit. And uh, that's where I broke in the business. And you mentioned Gino Hernandez. Uh, did you get along well with him? I got along great with Gino Hernandez. A lot of folks had trouble with the guy. You know, he was gorgeous Gino Hernandez. I mean, he's a real handsome young guy. He had all the women, made a lot of money. So a lot of folks were jealous. And he, he was a little abrasive. But I actually got along with Gino, and he helped me out quite a bit in the early days. And some people have speculated because of the way he died, the uh, cocaine overdose was found in his stomach. They speculated some foul play was involved. Uh, what do you think about that? Well, Gino, towards the end, he really got heavy into drugs. He was uh, shooting drugs in his body, so, you know, uh, he started hanging around with some shady people, so you, you never know, but he was taking a lot of drugs.